Hey Planner Babes, it's Amber from Amber Planter Day. Just want to come on and do a plan with me for my journal, Archer and Olive um, dot grid notebook. So make sure you stay tuned. This Archer and Olive notebook is one really, really pretty, and it's been really fun to journal in here, and I just have been really, really enjoying it. So I'm glad that I get to do it again. And this week, news plan anything, plan anything stickers from her um, Autumn Florals and Pumpkins sticker book. I think they're so pretty. I like love the trucks colors of those fall florals just like super gorgeous so um i do feel like i need more paper though i've really been enjoying using my paper in it so i guess i need to find some i kind of think i'm just gonna use like the rest of the paper that i did not use last week at least some of it i think I do want to cut the, this off because I don't want to use the florals. Let's, there we go. Hmm. How do I want to do this? Let's see. I do not think that was going to work, but we'll see what happens here. Not awful. that look a little bit more natural and then something I just saw somebody do and actually I don't even know if they did this it just looked like they did this when I saw their picture on Instagram I don't even remember who it was but they kind of like crumpled it up okay and then they like put it down kind of like that and it kind of gave some like character I guess we're gonna try it I mean I already crumpled it up and that's the only only like brown paper that I saw that I have so uh, I guess that's kind of my only option is to try it I thought that was so creative I love that idea so whoopsies Ugh, the same thing come on So it kind of like looks like, yeah, I guess it kind of looks a little bit more texturized. And then I do just have a little bit to cut off here. And a little bit up here too. Okay. I kind of wonder like if I like, like if I kind of like, Tear some here and some up here and then I kind of like journal in between here I feel like that could totally work I think I like that Do -do -do. I need to go to the craft store and buy some more paper because I've been really enjoying using some paper um, in my spreads lately. Okay, let's try that there. And then let's also go with this one. At the top up here. Oh, I like that. 
Oh, I forgot to crumple those ones up. That's okay. I only have one that looks like kind of natural, I guess. Okay, now this is plan anything. Autumn florals and pumpkins, and I don't know which ones I want to use. I really do like these ones. I have some boxes that match. Or in the back, maybe someone with those pumpkins. I don't want Halloween yet. Oh, I did want to use one of these cards though. So if I use these cards, I need to use pumpkins, which is fine. Um, I think we're gonna put this here. So um, Plan Anything does do like gloss stickers. So there is like a little bit of the shine on there, but otherwise it's super, it's like so clear and so, it's like thin, it's really nice. It's super high quality. So I'm thinking I need some pumpkins that will match this. So I'm thinking maybe these ones. And like, if you're just like looking at this, you can barely see through it. And then when you put it down, it's like magic. It's like a magical clear sticker. I love it. Um, let me try to use uh, just a floral bunch. I think we are going to try to do it this way. Okay, let's see if there's any of those boxes that match. These are all florals. So I wanted to see where those trucks were. If any, if they had any boxes. Ooh, the trees are really pretty. I might need to use a tree. Hmm, okay. I think we're gonna have to use this. These um, pages. I think we'll use this one. Kind of put that one here. And then maybe one over here, like in this corner to kind of initiate like the date. Um, with like, I think this kind of, so I'm going to write the, the month up here and like the days in here. And then let's go back to the florals and pumpkins page. Try to add some more of those. Like, even just like a small pumpkin, something like that, just to like add a little bit. I love kind of making my own little clusters of things. And then I'll see like maybe another car to kind of get like this same feel, but I don't know where I'd put it. So maybe not. Maybe not. But I do think. I can use some Amber Plants Day quotes, fall quotes. Hey, pumpkin. And fall is my favorite. And I still have so much room to journal and even do something over here. That is super pretty. And then I think um, I'm going to take like this Archer and Olive pen. This is the one that I keep having trouble with for some reason. September 13 through 19. Cute. Ooh, I really like this. I don't know, I feel like I could use more florals or something. Oh, are those the same ones? No, this has like a purplish in it. And the other ones are mostly like brown and browns. 
maybe maybe like a pumpkin up here. Hmm. Has anybody ever done this? Like where they like, we're gonna cut this right down the line. I don't even know if I need to cut it. But I'm thinking that might be kind of cool. And then like maybe you can just put the other half up here. Ooh, I kind of like that. And then maybe a pumpkin down here too. I, I changed my mind. <laughs> I regret my decision. Maybe just down here by this floral. Cute. Okay. I think we're done then. I like that. I like that a lot. I've so been loving. Like, this is just a totally different, like, kind of creative challenge for me. Did I, like, cut the paper a little bit? I think. Jeez, that is just not good. Oh gosh. Okay, that's not bad. Okay. Yeah, I think I really like this. This just like doing a bullet journal like this has just been a totally fun and different kind of thing for me. So I really, really like that. I like it a lot. Thank you guys so much for following along as I plan in my Archer and Olive dot grid journal that I use for journaling. I hope you guys will continue to follow along as I plan my life day to day and continue to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.